Hi guys, it's Allie with Chaos Monkey and I just got my Mary Maxim Knit Club for May and I haven't peeked or anything. Um, I know the Crochet Club got cotton and I think it's like what the second or third month we've gotten cotton so far this year and I got cotton. I pretty much got the same thing the Crochet Club did just in different colors and of course the different patterns so um, this is our version. Here, let me take it out of the plastic here. But it's the dishcloth and dish towels. And on top of that, we got charged extra this month because um, they decided to go with UPS, and I don't know why. So instead of $21.49, which is usually what I get charged, I got charged $24.44. Because shipping was 11 look at you, look at this, you guys. This is the price of the kit, $12.99. They just charged me $11.45 in shipping. And didn't tell us ahead of time that they were going to do that. And it was delivered in my mailbox, so it was UPS to the mail. Um, which should be cheaper. Not directly from UPS to your door. Because a lot of times people use UPS and then drop it off at your local mail distributor, U.S. Postal, and then they finish delivering it. So, yeah. Um, so, and at more, at $25, $24.44. So, am I wrong in thinking they're supposed to notify you if they increase the shipping? Because some people are on really tight budgets. But anyway, um, big ass ball of cotton in the color rosy cheeks. And sorry, my colors. Oh, it's pretty. It's a pretty true to color. My lighting isn't that bad. That's a lot of cotton, and it's just premier. It's premier home. So it's pretty good. It's softer than um, Lillian. What is that? Sugar and cream, and the other one that says something and cream. It's softer than that. Um, and then we've got the three little balls. This one's in, these are actually part polyester. My bad. This is 85% cotton and 15% polyester. So it's not 100% cotton for all of these. They're all 85 cotton, 15 polyester. These little guys just have 131 on the yards for the accent colors. Um... This green is sage, the blue is cornflower, and the taupe beige is beige. <laughs> and then, of course, this big one was that funky name, wasn't it? Rosy Cheeks. So it's nice cotton, it's just not worth $24.44, um, or even the $12.99 for the cotton and maybe the pattern. Maybe we're doing okay. And it looks like it's seed stitch and garter for the knitting. There's no other pictures on the inside. It's for two towels, a dishcloth, size 9 needles. So yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of disappointed in what they're sending. Because I think this is the second dish towel set too, isn't it? Am I wrong on that, you guys? For Because um, remember, I skipped a month. And I think the month I skipped which was the month before last, was also, no, it was a doily. It was like a cotton doily and uh, that the Crochet Club got, which I'm sure the Knit Club would have got something equivalent. So I skipped that one, trying to dodge the cotton bullet, if you will, and then I won the jackpot here. Um, it's pretty cool. I like this, but when you knit it up, it just looks like this. Uh, with the seed stitch, um, because it's such short color changes, it's going to be blurpy. It would be even more blurpy in crochet. Um, so it looks kind of busy, I guess. But yeah, and then there's some slip stitches here from the garter into the next color. So, I mean, it's simple pattern. But the last dish cloth set I got it was just like this. It had, um, I did a video on it. It had a a boat. It was nautical themed and I'm like who am I going to give this to and I still have a ton of le leftovers because they gave you some of the scrubby yarn which is really hard to knit with so I didn't 
I did like one washcloth scrubby and then it was like no and then I had some leftover cotton. Well they gave you at least the buttons to put up here. So they gave you some of the extras uh, with that kit. But this one is, I guess they just expect you to sew it shut or... Because before they gave you buttons. Um, yeah, they want you to make a button. Is that what they're saying? Using contrast color 3, make and attach a button as before. In this kit, we made a button using the cotton. However, if you feel you would like to use an actual button, please feel free to do so. Yeah, so this time they didn't even send you any of the little uh, buttons or anything. So, um, especially with the price increase, you guys, I'm, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep doing this, because if they're going to keep the shipping at the $11, the shipping is just as much as the freaking kit. That's like, that's all shipping. That's 50% shipping. Um, and plus with all the cotton and, I don't know, I don't know what's going on with their kits. Um, with their color choices and the patterns and then just with so much cotton already. I know it's summer, but, um, I don't know, you guys, I just, I'm kind of cottoned out. I was trying to get through my cotton stash, honestly, but, you know, I can always make a ton of washcloths and everything, um, after I make these. So I'll probably end up making them, and then, um, maybe give it away as a gift, or, or whatever. But, um, for the increase in price, I may end up having to cancel, though, and just put my money in another club. Uh, there's quite a few... Indie clubs um, that are like $22 a month, 20 bucks a month, including the shipping, so no extra for the shipping, that I can get, you know, fingers and a fingering weight hand dyed uh, for that price instead of getting, you know, a crap ton of cotton for $24 to almost $25. Um, and I really would hate to cancel and then have the following month be like an awesome month, you know, that they give you tons of cool yarn. So, yeah, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Um, and they're nice colors. I mean, just like these three colors. These are at least colors you can give as gifts and things. They're not crazy. This one's a little more crazy and the huge ball. But, again, you, you could still gift it, you know. Um... I wonder how much, I mean, one of these towels doesn't, how much, oh, that's right, they don't tell you the yardage on the on the individual pieces. That's one thing I don't like about these patterns, is they don't tell you how much it takes for each piece, so you can calculate if you want to change things around. They just give you what the total yardage in the ball, and then the dimensions of the pieces, but not the yardage usage. So I am assuming you can do way more than two of these dish towels, or three of these, uh, dish towels out of this guy. That's a lot of, a lot of cotton. So, yeah, um, I'm disappointed with the price increase. Um, if they had told me that when I had to call them to fix my billing issue, I probably would have said just never mind. <laughs> you know, oh, by the way, we're raising it. There was no email or anything. There was no, I don't know if this is a regular thing or you know, they didn't say anything on the phone like being behind on shipping or having to rush it out with the UPS. So if they're changing this regularly, then I'm not going to pay for a club where the shipping is 50%. So, and also that's another problem I have with um, Mary Maxim is because I've tried to go on their site and buy things from them. Like I literally put three balls of yarn in my cart and the shipping was $15. And that's from Michigan to Washington State, you guys. Uh, so I just leave. I empty my cart and I leave. Um, and I've tried that several times, like with coupons and stuff, and the shipping has always been ridiculously high for Mary Maxim. And I don't understand why, because there's so many other companies that, um, are in the U.S. that can ship so much cheaper, and the same type of companies. Um, oh, I'm never going to get that back in there. Um, so yeah, I, I don't buy stuff from them. I've had stuff I've wanted to buy from them before. Um, 
and I couldn't because the shipping was so insane. Um, regular thing. Um, so I might call them just to ask them about the shipping issue and then also if they're going to keep sending cotton because <laughs> I'll be like, do you guys know how many future kits are going to be cotton <laughs> for the for the summer? <laughs> because uh, we've had a lot of cotton so far and a lot of the similar colors. You'll notice that sometimes they'll send us like the same colors over and over. I think somebody was saying the crochet club was kept getting greens and blues on top of cotton. Um, and so it doesn't, I don't know if they're planning ahead or looking at the whole year or the, at least the next six months to plan these out um, to make sure. Because I remember last year the knit club was always getting the same colors, which was like oranges and reds in the majority of them. And the crochet club was always getting purples in the majority of them. And it was, we were noticing it, it was so often. And then now I think it's greens and blues for the crochet. And now I'm... I'm kind of getting reds and peaches so far for the knitting for the majority color. I don't know, you guys. I'm just rambling. So, I don't know. For the shipping, I'm really, really disappointed. Um, and the cotton is cotton. I'm disappointed, but I'm, I'm okay with it. I can definitely use it. Um, and you got, you know, we got a lot of yardage. And it would be decent for the, you know, price range $12 for this in a pattern but then when they jacked up the shipping to over almost $12 that detracts from this if you know what I mean any any value you're feeling so all right you guys I'm gonna go I'm rambling um, I am gonna try to put out a couple of more videos here in the next few days so um, okay you guys I love you I'll talk to you later bye